All right, so it's snowing and I'm bored. But my little guys are having fun. Look at this, my track's all snowed in, and by the looks of it, it's gonna be that way for a while. And I gotta find something to do. And I suppose I should probably be out shoveling or plowing up my shop, but it's a snow day, and it wouldn't really be a snow day if I spent it working, so I thought about building a cloud buster, because I got a lot of these 87 cloud buster kits still in the package. Got a few more over there. There's the USA one. But Pretty much every flat surface in my house is occupied by a cloudbuster. Alright, so the snow stopped and uh, I plowed a little spot to bash the super cloudbuster in. I haven't used this thing in a while, so I don't know, I figured I'd take it out for a spin. This thing's pretty much bone stock other than the wheels. And uh, they're those nice two piece aluminum wheels. And they got the hex machine into them, so you don't need to run these little wheel adapters like the stock wheels use. So it's just one less part, one less thing to go wrong, and uh, they look really cool. I definitely plan on upgrading this thing. I'll probably start with a set of ball bearings, a little bit hotter of a motor. I'm not going to go too crazy, though. And uh, before I run any of my cars in the snow, I like to just go through them and like um, kind of winterize them. I just take apart any electrical connection, put a little coating of dielectric grease, and what that does is... Any electrical contacts, it just makes sure um, moisture can't get in. And uh, it was pretty funny. I went to my local auto parts store. I'm not going to say which one, but I'll give you a hint. It starts with an A and ends with a zone. I asked for dielectric grease, and they looked at me like I was stupid, but they call it <laughs> bulb grease. I've never heard dielectric grease referred to as bulb grease before. So I thought that was pretty funny. It seems like there's... Uh, a rapid decline in intelligence in all the auto parts stores lately so it used to be they would hire people who knew what was going on but I guess nowadays they don't do that but anyway so I'm gonna take this thing for a spin see how this cloud does in the snow Thank you. 